folks. Jeff Love here with Kimmel Ministries, working with Deep Creek Outdoors this weekend. I'm a long drive from Alabama to Ohio. Uh, we're excited to be here at Ohio Giant Bucks. Uh, we'll share more with you about that in a minute. we got a neat weekend going on. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a process been going on since about the end of June, first part of July. Uh, really excited. We've got a call opportunity that we could find a young person to bring up here that's maybe facing challenges and uh, the owner of this place, Ken, said, we can find somebody and we'll work a deal. And so uh, we started making some phone calls. And a young man that I had been talking to on Facebook and met uh, runs a group out of West Virginia called Grunt, Gobble, and Gills, which was Zach Lucas. And I told Zach what we had going on. He said, I think I'm going to have somebody to talk to. And next thing I know, I get a phone call from Daryl Roberts with uh, Deer Creek Outdoors and Bone Crusher Minerals. And we start talking about different folks. And Daryl's here today. Daryl, come on in here and join me real quick. Good to see you. Jeff, how are you doing? Good, man. Great to see you. Me too. Great to see you. We've visited on the phone for a long time. And we're finally meeting face to face today. Uh, Daryl has a company and they've developed a great mineral. Uh, it's doing some good things with a lot of deer, but growing some good bone, some good antlers on some deer. Uh, we met by phone through Zach, and uh, you said that you had a friend who had a son who faced some challenges in life. And we said, we'd like to try to work together to get this young man on the hunt. And, uh, can you just tell me from there what, what you did? Yes, well, what we did was we actually, uh, I knew of, of a friend of mine that had a son uh, by the name of Houston Cove. And uh, Houston had been battling leukemia uh, for quite a while. And, and I know his dad for a while. Dad had shared uh, through, through some of the experiences that they've endured uh, while Houston was getting treatments. And, and the one thing that really impressed me was that Houston has the heart of a lion. Uh, there was no quit in the kid, just had a positive attitude, worked hard, went to school, uh, several stories I could share if we had time, but uh, very impressed by the young man and his attitude, and that was the first name that popped into my head. So uh, with, with that being said, uh, when, once I was contacted, and uh, Zach Lucas contacted me uh, from Grant Goblin Gills, uh, about if I knew some, somebody that could use that, and Houston's name was the first name, I uh, told Zach, I know exactly the child we need to take on this hunt. And uh, from there on, uh, it was between Zach and, and Jeff Love that uh, we were able to make this happen today. You know, we were real lucky in the fact that, uh, you know, the guys at Deep Creek Outdoors had, had had contact with Kenneth and them here at Ohio Giant Bucks, and so we kind of, the hunt started falling together, and we worked on this, and this would change, and, but one thing never changes is that God opened doors for us to be here. And God provided a chance for us all safe travels to get here. And he's provided us with a great young man that I'm going everybody to meet right now. Houston, come on here and join us, bro. Good to meet you, bro. I'm glad you're here. Well, it's finally here. We've been talking about this for a while. I got to see a little video footage when you were surprised. Did you know that day your dad your dad got you in the truck and said, let's go see Mr. Darrell. Did you have an idea what Mr. Darrell was going to talk to you about? No, I did not. I could tell because when I watched that video, your face just lit up. I would give me anything to have been there. I know it was a great honor to be a part of yeah, that. Yeah, very much. And this is the excitement that you had. Now, you love the outdoors. You like to hunt, right? Yeah. You ever killed your good buck? No. And we shot those. Shot those. Well, today we're going after a good one, aren't we? Yep. We're going to get us one today. Yep. We've had a lot of fun, you know. And as we as we were traveling up last night, we uh, I said y'all had about a thirty minute ride, and Daryl had about a forty five minute ride. We had a ten hour ride, so we got to talk a lot about this hunt, how excited we were. You know, we kept coming back to one thing, and that's the blessings that God's given us. You know, God's provided us with the opportunity to hunt. He, he let us be born in a country where we're free. We talked we were talking about our country a while ago that we're Americans and we have the freedom that we can enjoy to do the things we want to do. And that's something our forefathers and our military ensures for us today to ensure those God blessings we've had. But you know, you, you've battled some things in your life. You've battled leukemia. And uh, I believe, it was, was it four years you've had leukemia you've been battling it? Uh, two. Two years, two years, I'm sorry. Two years you've been battling it and right now, are you still in treatment now? Yes, I still get up once a month and uh, uh, three out of four months I have to give you a uh, spinal tap mm -hmm. and the rest of the, the three months I just go for the uh, just to get the treatments. Just treatments and stuff. Well, uh, we're praying for you and, and we know God's going to keep working in your life and keep and, and keep growing you and making you healthy uh, and, and for your dad. We know your dad's there supporting you the whole way and 
And that's important to have that support. And we want you to know that that uh, Deer Creek Outdoors and Grub Goblin Gills, Deer Creek Outdoors and Kennel Ministries, we're supporting you too. Okay. And we're going to be there with you the long haul. Uh, today, we're not going to think about leukemia. Yeah. We're not going to think about homework or school. <laughs> we're going to go out today. We're going to we're going to go after a big buck. We're going to try to put one on the ground today. We're going to come back tonight and celebrate, have a big dinner, and laugh. There's a guy here with us who can't tell me he's the fastest deer skinner in America. So he can skin a deer faster than anybody in America. And he said, if you want to, he'll show you how fast he can skin your buck tonight. That sounds good to me. And that's good because it means that you and I don't have to do it, right? Yeah, yeah that's exactly right. That's what we want. Well, I think Daryl has talked to Zach. Uh -huh. And uh, Zach has sent a couple of gifts down here for you. He has. And uh, you like to share it Daryl show he, you. Yeah, uh, he definitely said he hated that he could not be here today. There's just some conflicts that they just could not get free. And so he sent me a care package this week to, to give to you. And uh, I'll, I'll have Jeff here get that, and uh, we'll, we'll set you straight. There's a few things in this package. From, from Zach, I'll get I'll get our stuff out of the way because what he has at the bottom of this is the most important thing probably you'll ever have in your life. But this right here, outside of your family, but this right here, this is from Deer Creek Outdoors. Man, get you taken care of for that deer tonight. Actually, why don't you use that to skin the deer with? Or watch him skin. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Unless you want to well, get that one. Nice, nice. Look at that. Uh, we got you a. DVD to pass away your time with. That's going to be good. Yeah, another DVD. Yeah. yeah. And uh, we also got you a uh, Deer Creek Outdoors. This is our breast cancer awareness shirt. Um, and this is the guy color. This is the black and the white. We have black and white paint. But that is that is for you too. From us. So, uh, from Zach and Grunt Gobble and Gills. And I'll tell you, it's been a real blessing just on Deer Creek Outdoors Park to work with people like Jeff Love, to work with people like Zach Lucas. Uh, when we started Deer Creek Outdoors, one of my missions was to make enough money that I could bless others. And we're working every day to make that happen, even in the small ways. Yeah. I know these guys have devoted their time and their lives to this, and uh, we're, we're trying to do the same thing as well. Uh, Zach and Grunt Goblin Gills, uh, they are just a, a great bunch of fellows. And they wanted to give you a hat uh, from them, the Triple G with the arrow through it. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to ask Zach for one of those. Yeah. I, one of those. <laughs> I like that hat. That's pretty cool. And this is probably the most important gift that you could ever get. And that is, thank you, Jeff. Yes, sir. That is the Bible. It's camouflage. So when you go in the woods, make sure you mark a little orange tape or something. So you can <laughs> And uh, it's got your name and everything inside the book. So we want to make sure that you get that. And Zach has written a very nice letter to you inside the uh, the uh, Bible, a nice inscription. So get a time to read that later. Thank you for doing this. Yeah. I would yeah. like to uh, thank Zach for seeing that. Oh, very, very good. Appreciate. Very good. Well, hopefully one day we can get you guys together and you can meet yeah. in person. Yeah. Because he sure likes it. Yeah, he, I, I talked to him on the phone this week. And he was really, he was really sad. He wasn't able to make it. He was hoping to make it down this evening to see you. But he, he really wants you to know that he's praying for you. And he's looking forward to us texting him for pictures of a deer in a little bit. Oh, so, absolutely. You know, we got to work on that. But I just want to say for me uh, and, and our group from Kemmel Ministries and Dick Creek Outdoors, it's a pleasure to meet you. You know, I look forward to our future. You know, we hear so much today about the future of America and people worry about where this country's heading. Well, with a young man like this, Daryl, we don't have any to worry about. No, no. He's, you know. uh, he sets an example for most of his classmates. Yeah, we've had I know some of them. Oh, so okay. I so know some know. of them. So I know, you know, he's, he's cut from good stock. Yeah. Well, sure. it's a blessing. We've been in camp now for two or three hours and we had lunch. And that was the most important thing. We unloaded, ate lunch. We went outside visiting, drove around the land a little bit. But from the time he got a truck, it was yes, sir, and, and very polite. So that shows what this young man's made of. And so it's a blessing to be around you. I look forward to being a part of your hunt this weekend, just being a fly on the wall. Uh, but we're going to have a lot of fun. God bless you, man. We're praying for you. Darrell, thank sure. you for your part. Yeah, thank you so much. We appreciate it. Y'all stay tuned. Next, we're going to be getting into this thing.
Thank you guys.